What's up guys, back again, bringing you a video today about some of these bridges I've seen coming across on AliExpress now. And they're really interesting, I've never seen designs like some of these before. Uh, there's two of them that I'll show you that are kind of uh, thinking out of the box here. This one here is a non-locking tremolo bridge, brass block, and saddle. And this is, I would guess this one is for a headless, they don't show the headless... Um, I don't show the headless clamps, but I mean, I guess you could use it either way. Um, but this design is very different from what I've seen in the past, um, simply because they it's like they've mixed. They have this new design now where they have the screw right here, which the string sets in the groove there. And then when you want to raise it, you just, um, you know, you turn the screw one revolution or turn it back. The only thing I don't like about this design is that maybe you don't need a full revolution on the turn to raise the string to you know get past a high fret or just get past something maybe you want the string to be a little bit lower and you have to go a full revolution uh, precise you know wouldn't be as precise as the kind that have two allen screws but uh, i do really like the design it looks like a very simple design uh, not sure exactly where it came from there are some bridges out there if you ever look for some of the headless ones called Sophia, but they're terribly expensive, um, but they're actually really nice. This one comes in gold and black, and it's not too bad. They've got a little brass block on there, so obviously this is a floating uh, version of it, but I'm sure if you took this brass block off and the whammy, uh, the little whammy chamber there, a cavity for it, kind of like I do with my Steinberger, I'm pretty sure you could just top mount it, and it would still work just fine, but this one, Pretty cool little bridge here. Not too bad. I'm not sure. Let's see, $70. Eh, that's not too bad for a bridge like this. Uh, the other one I, I was going to show you is this one here. This for $300 is ridiculous. I don't know where they actually get their pricing for this. This is kind of the same as the NK one I have, except for they've made the these tuners square now, so I guess they fit together a little better. Then the round ones, it would look, you know, more like a square bridge. Again, they're going with the screw on top with a, you know, kind of a, I forget. So, so <laughs> it's, like, it's too early to be making videos. Like a cavity there for the string to go through. Not a cavity, but like a trench. I don't know. The word escapes me. It's way too early for this shit. But yeah, this is... This is a pretty cool looking little bridge, but the fact that they want $300 for it is pretty much ridiculous. I would definitely not pay $300 for something like this. Uh, I would get the round ones at the very least and pay significantly less because it's going to do the same thing. I mean, look at down here, the round one's $36. And this final bridge here is one, uh, Again, this is the same type of design, you know, the screw top, the string goes through, but this is like a top mount. This is definitely not a floating. Um, I'm not sure exactly what material. It doesn't really look, it looks like powder coated steel. Um, not exactly sure what they've made it out of, but it looks nice. I mean, it's not a bad looking bridge. Uh, it definitely is a headless bridge, though, because you can see they have the top. Um, where was the top picture at? I don't know. It was somewhere on here. But yeah, this is a $39 isn't too bad. Of course, you know, I'd be kind of skeptical of a bridge that's $39 unless I had used it before and seen that it's a really good deal. But yeah, check out some of these bridges on AliExpress now. They're really coming up with some unique designs, and it's good to see that because of the one that I had with the NK like this one right here with the Allen screws. If you actually lose these little screws here, right here on the left, if you lose that, you're kind of screwed. Those things are so tiny, and to find a replacement for that is terribly hard. So yeah, I mean, you can do more micro adjustments on the ones with the Allen screws as opposed to the other one where you just raise and lower, you know, like a main screw. Um, but yeah, it's just you got to be really careful that you never, ever lose those little screws that go in there that raise and lower the action. But anyways, guys, once again, AliExpress delivering some of the weirdest shit, but <laughs> a welcome 
a welcome addition for some of these bridges. Some of these would be actually pretty cool on another guitar. This one, like I said, this one kind of reminds me of that Evertune uh, design. But yeah. Anyways, guys, check them out. Bridges on AliExpress. See ya.